Hey folks, welcome back to Forever Skies. Well, the rain just stopped. Here I was wanting to start it by stressing how much water is running down those sails and filling up that thing. And yeah, just like last time I was about to tell you about the rain running in on the glass. And then just as I hit record, everything changes, of course. Anyway, this jar of green heaven that we found last time, according to the comments I'm getting, it's just an artifact. It is a leftover from a time long gone and it's just for us to display. Well, I'm going to memorialize it by displaying it right in the middle of where our future growing beds are going to be, should the game ever actually add those in. So, it lives there. <laughs> Meanwhile, let's... Hmm, I was going to say let's get off to that question mark. Uh, top corner up there. 2.56, that's actually a long way away. But it might be a good idea to go ahead and get some of the, uh, the engines and turbos um, upgraded. Now, what does that actually mean? I need motherboards and polymers. Ugh. Okay. Well, polymers. Well, we actually have more than I, than I thought. Okay. So let's just grab all those. <clears throat> motherboards are what? Um, your circuit boards and copper and plastic and a lot of each okay so I think one stack maybe two stacks and I'll yeah it was one each you think about that uh, let's go over here nope nope wrong one that's why I'm not seeing what I'm supposed to be seeing there we go so one of you yeah so I need two of those for that and where are you? Right there. Oh, transformers I need for this. Okay, so 5, 10, uh, 18 polymer, 2 motherboards, and 8 transformers. Wow. We have 5. Well, that's not bad. Transformers are these and these, if I'm correct. So, little by little, let's, let's build this thing. No, it's not. Oh, what? I thought I grabbed a stack of each. Did I really just grab one? Somehow I grabbed one. Okay, <clears throat> let's get you going. And you going. I think those are faster than motherboards. No, apparently I'm wrong. They're going to take a while. So what else needs to be done while we're waiting? Um, I guess we could go get them. Alright, let's do that. Let's do all four. I think four is overkill. But let's just do it anyway Printing just so they're even um what do I want here Q and turn that off or do I want to do just two of them let's do just two for now boy it's weird walking over nothing uh the two rear ones right yeah okay and I'll go down this one that didn't work okay there and there, drop down. Okay, so now I need. Uh, let's grab two motherboards while I'm here. I need one more transformer yet, but the transformers are for the engines. So we could grab those, I guess, too. How much room do I have? And let's just do the, the one thing at a time. Okay, you guys are three quarters done. Printing completed. There we go. One of you, and let's grab one more, and let's make one more just to have something in stock. Okay, so I want here, uh, build me one of these, and maybe we'll make two more motherboards if it will let us, just to have those in stock. Um, so engines are next. What's done? Oh, you guys are both done. Okay, both of you. Can we do a motherboard? We can do two. Okay. Alright, so... We should be done with all of these. And those and those. I believe. And plastics, I think we're done Printing with. Completed. Printing completed. Okay, you guys... <clears throat> And 
any second now. There we go. All right, so another one of you. So that was just polymer, and you were polymer. Oh, we need the engine. Okay, so another one of you. Okay, so that actually gives me enough room. Let's go ahead and get the engines. All of you and Q. And, oh, didn't pop up in my face. All right, all of you and Q. Perfect. So we're dead in the water right now. Until he's done. Yep. Creepy gnome. I wonder if Mr. Gnome should keep Mr. Poncho uh, company. I wonder what he would think about that. <laughs> Is that good or bad? <laughs> hey, dude. Let's see here. Three. Yeah, you guys can uh, can have interesting conversations together. Printing completed. Yeah. All right, let's go put some engines, or some turbines in. You and get you going. And three. <clears throat> I got both of them? Yeah, I got both of them. So that really tall structure that has the catwalk in it takes more than just standard turbines, I believe. Although it may be that you can put a whole bunch of standard turbines to equal the advanced turbines. That might be a thing, I'm not sure. Okay, you grab where? Position blocked. Oh, there we go. Right there. And same thing here. This one? Yeah. It's real finicky placing these things. Placing anything on this ship. The ship building mechanism is a little bit wonky. Takes some getting used to. Um, yep, in my face. Alright, get you going. And three... How are we doing otherwise? Um, I think I've only got... Well, I've got a critter good for two days, and I've got the sun melons good for a day and a half. Or a day. Okay, that's water and food. So, wait till the food goes down a little more and we'll start eating those. Otherwise, an engine. Yeah, I'll go ahead and make two trips. I'm going to bring them both out here at once, but this gives us something to do while we're waiting. Uh, boy, that mounts a little bit differently. Oh, I'm up here. That's why it's it feels odd. Okay. Whoa. That's right. We get two now. So if we were to do that, we could run a hundred of something else just to get it used up. So a hundred of you in there. So cheap stuff and the better stuff. Then grab you, and we could even go another route. We could go the 17. I mean, it's just a way of getting some of the stuff used up. But, yeah, there isn't enough of either to make it worth it, so we'll just go in with these guys. Okay. Three. You're going way up. Somewhere in that area is a spot. Good. And put you in and you in. Alright, so we've got a faster ship that can go higher. We're raining. I think we're done enough with this greenhouse. There were still plants up there I could get, but <clears throat> it's not that important. Let's move on. We're heading kind of off in that, that direction. Of course, we're. I just went to click that and it didn't work. <laughs> Let's click this one. <laughs> Alright, up, over, and... That's right. I saw that when I was editing, and and it was brought up in the comments. As I shifted this over to copper, it had grabbed a synthetic. So, nope, oh, wrong one. That's right. To do this, you have to hold the E now, instead of just click it. So now we're going after copper. Synthetics, glass, everything is correct. Synthetics, glass, yeah, we're all correct now. And while I'm here, let's grab these. <clears throat> All right, water. Put you in. Ah, we're uh, we're full on clean water. Okay. All right, where was I? Heading. Actually, pretty much due north or due 
that way. And no more landing on top of buildings. <laughs> that was a little creepy. Where am I at? 277? Let's kick it up into closer to 300. There we're going. Um, actually, going a little bit further this way. There you are. So we'll make kind of a speed run. Oh, this, this game is so nice when it clears up. We'll make a speed run through a lot of these smaller ones. My past? I think so. But I can't see where I'm going anymore, so let's drop our altitude. Not dropping into anything. 60s, 50s. We need to be down to 30. There we are. Um, actually, sure. Let you guys do your thing over here. Open up the structure. Got anything? Here, we'll pivot in. There, grab the glass. Go down a little lower so I can see it. Yeah, I guess that's it. Okay. And I could actually land right there. I could. Let's go forward a bit, since I can't strafe in. And take it up some. Spin over. And back. Where did you go? I think it's under me. I can't quite see where I'm going now. Where'd the building go? <laughs> okay, back up. Oh, there it is. I see. So, the door is... Hmm, where's an opening? It must be on the other side. So how do I get there from here? I guess right in that side. Okay. Um, now, let's go up. Oh, that's not the up. Let's go up to here. I think I like that a lot better. Alright, drop in. Just like so. Perfect. And you still have battery. You do too, but what's all the red down here? Uh, I don't know. Maybe it's a light from underneath that's coming through. Okay. Alright, Sun Melon. One. Okay, plastics. Alright, so where are we going to move the crystal and energy supplies in that one cabinet so that I can split up the plastic, glass, and copper cabinet into multiples. Something over there has got to leave. I only have six cabinets by placing that, uh, that one workbench in my storage room. So I'm going to have to come up with another way to deal with that. Um, there's two of you guys. I'll take it. Okay, so we're good here. Nope, there's another one of you too. Ah. Oh, nope. Nope. There. It's always spooky when they're right at the edge like that. You. Is there another one? Nope. And jump. Oh, so clunky. All right, so let's go this way and down. Bingo. The pathway I always miss. Was there anything on the outside? It wasn't, right? No. Alright. Speed run in here. Grab everything real quick. And turn three off. Okay. Good there. Um, there is or was an update. Data card. Chrome. More paint. That I just saw come across Twitter. Or should I start saying across X? That's... I think there is officially no longer a Twitter out there that um, immediately there will be more posters in the game and a few more things like that that uh, are being kind of withheld and kept secret so you'd be surprised when you find them. Kind of like that Green Earth surprised me or Green Heaven. Um, but I saw a picture or a rendering of the um, plant-like beings, animals, 
spores, gigantic spores that are going to attack your ship floating in the air. Let's see, I can get down there. Okay, I think I'm going to call this one done. Let's try that again. Um, though, was there any glass to grab? I have a glass metal. You know, let's go ahead and set one of these to metal. I guess so. Right there. So, switch you. Okay, hopefully you went that way. Good. Your metal. Yeah, I guess I'll go ahead and do it. We don't see enough glass to justify this. There we go. You... Okay, you'll grab it out of there. Okay. All right, so with that, let's go up and back and continue... Uh, question mark. We're pivoting that way. I think I'm going to... Well, hate to skip them because there are data cards on some of them. This one, with the flashing light is quick. Morse code, almost like, or SOS. So, let's go up... So, we'll bring the extractor with us. Okay, you guys take everything out over there. Thank you very much. Fuel is looking good. <clears throat> uh, that's not looking good. Okay, need space. So this one is going to have to split up soon. There and there. And probably into this one. So these have got to go somewhere else. <laughs> this is full of our biologicals. This is full of fuel. So probably fuel needs to go somewhere else. Not sure exactly where. We could put some cabinets right in here, I guess. Yeah, that makes sense. Or at least two of them. Or it's even possible this guy could go here and all of this could go over there. And they just extend the, the building section around the corner. Ooh, I think I like that. Where was I? <laughs> okay, you, you, and you, and you, and over here, dump off that one. And we've got some of these to get rid of. We've got a sun melon to make food out of. I think we have more than enough lures at the moment. And let's drop water into you, boil. That will clear up the, the water problem. So I can pull the rest of that out of there and put you in. Okay, so soda, or well, water, which I think we're about out of room. Speaking of lures, and polymers. Oh, and also see... Ah, I see what, what's going on. So you kind of go in here too, and you're supposed to be in there. And that... That spot normally is filled with these. I always run around with first aid kits on me. And it's not often that I don't. So let's get back into that habit. Just like bringing the extraction tool and bringing the knife with me wherever I go. Okay, is that everything? Nope. One more there. Rain's coming down harder. You're going to... Whoa, you are going to storm on me, aren't you? What was that noise? Oh, the cooker's done. Okay. All right, so there. we got a building there, a building here. Plastics. None. Wow. Okay. Uh, the inn on this one is... Huh. It looks like it's over there. So, how do we get over there? Okay, it's not that one. Yeah, creep along. Yeah, four. And this time it's not a crossbow bolt. <laughs> Alright, what's in here? Nope, did not get my data pad like I was hoping. But I'll always take all of those. Uh, four. Let's just grab any glass. You're not. Okay. Uh, you. No. This one was... The cabinets were all empty for the most part. Yeah. Nothing back there. Nothing missed. Nothing above. Okay. 
four away. Wow, that went down quick. So I won't drink too much. Just go eat those sun melons. I'll do water and food. Okay, four. Doors on that side, which means this way. And more glass. Ah, there we go. Oh, that's a, that's a lure. It wasn't a data pad. Darn. And neither was that. Okay, one hiding over here. <laughs> a, a repair patch. Okay, up above, just an old flat screen TV. Okay. And apparently didn't... Uh, didn't have a screensaver set on it, so we burn out the, the screen. <laughs> okay. <clears throat> Turn the brightness off. No thunder and lightning. Good. Touch more water. We done with this one? Okay, up above. Actually, I thought for sure I'd find a sun melon here. Just kind of felt that way. But apparently not. Okay, did I get the... Not get the battery yet, which means this way. Uh huh. There. There. Oh, we gotta go up further. Second, so where'd the battery go? Okay, so from here I can kind of go down to. There and um, I'm no, I, I, I don't think so. Uh, now nah, I'm gonna go this way. Whoa, <laughs> all right. So the ship is hiding over here. Wait a minute, I just saw that in my peripheral vision. All right, done with this one. Now let's go make some distance. Actually, let's go eat some melons. Alright, both of you. Boom, boom. Okay, got our stats up pretty good there. Um, let's go put away some repair kits. That's the one thing that's going to overwhelm us here. We're going to run out of room on those. Okay, so we need to make some time. Let's head that direction toward that question mark and just... See what these engines can do. Let's open this thing up. So, gain more height. A little further. Right in there and go. So that's only two supercharged engines. Imagine having four. I've seen videos with four and it's, it's a rush. It, it really is. Especially when you have something next to you so you can compare it. You know, suddenly that building just zips past you sort of thing. All right, so that blue flashing light is the greenhouse, and I think we'll skip that one. Let's see what is beyond. Actually, I'm seeing quite a silhouette over there. I think that's our target. That's that really, really tall one. Cool. Otherwise, gotta look around here. Fuel's doing fine. Greenhouse is there. Let's peek over here. Just looking at its shape and design. Looks pretty typical. Nothing nothing uh, special about it that makes me wonder and want to pull in there anyway. Alright. Well, we're trying really hard to zap something. Let's go ahead and come down a little bit give you guys a chance. We're up at the higher than we would be if we were uh, um, at the under the dust elevator. Now this one I believe has multiple landing places as well. Yeah, one low enough, you know, barely enough to, to reach if you've got like, I don't know, three or four turbines and then one if you're more advanced like what we've now got. Yeah, there it is. We're going to announce it soon. No, 
Yeah. Okay, well, let's... Let's see. Let's try the other up. There we go. Unknown location. 302. So I guess 300 would have got us here. Okay, well, good. So it's probably a 298. Or 300 even. <laughs> High point. Okay. So, let's go ahead and empty this. I don't know exactly what I'm getting into here. So, new objects are in there. Let me just see if there's more than than one. Uh, studies? Yeah. So, scanner. It's a wind farm variant. Ah, okay. So, we've got two objects in here. Ah, the docking plank and the recycler are both in here. Interesting. Okay, you're going in there. You are going there. Metals are here. And that's probably enough to do what we need. We have the extractor. We have the scanner. So that should cover about everything. Now we just need a good old lightning storm. Whoa. Okay, we're hitting this one first. And if we have room for water, sure. Grab you. I don't see coming back here. I think we can accomplish this right now. Is this anything? I do want to look everything over carefully, though. Now, so you are part of that shaft right there. So there was one even higher on point? I don't know. Huh. Alright, so if you're afraid of heights, close your eyes. <laughs> or I guess you have the power of the fast forward. Yeah. Probably gonna run out of water space here. Oh, we've got no we don't have another bottle. So when this one runs out, it runs out. Okay, so scan anything around here. Ooh, tanks, good. Alright, turn that off so I can concentrate on where I am. Both of you guys, so we are a wind farm variant. Hmm. Can I go this way? I can't. So I've got to go this way, huh? Yeah. This is exciting. Um, this way? That way. Oh, this is not good. Okay. What's the next plan? Around here. Let's turn... What is that, two? Turn you off. Get out of my face. And let's see if we can go this way. Oh, good. <laughs> yeah, that wasn't exciting. Okay, so we've got to get up there. Ah. I see what's up. Okay. This is it, but if you could only hit 300, you still wouldn't be able to get up there. That's what the challenge is. So you've got to get this, <clears throat> build it, install it. A storm is coming. A storm is coming. And yeah, we're, we're a little high, aren't we? Yeah. All right, let's go up, back, and down. We'll go down here and we'll build it. So that's just an arm. There is a windmill up there. Okay. So, wind farm variant. I get it. There's nothing below us. So let's head down into here. And don't know how far down we really need to go. We have all that structure above us. So let's play with the idea that it really will hit the highest point. Hello. Oh, we're about to die in here. No, we're going down. We're going to be pummeled hard. Okay. Down to 220. Get below the junk stream. Alright, right in there. Okay. Yeah. That's coming in at storm speed. Alright, five. We take any damage like our new uh, wind turbine? Or our new lift? No, we're good there, we're good there. So that's the difference. 
Let's see, five. Didn't really stop to look at it last time. That's her typical one. There's the new one. Oh, the, the bumps bumped us down. Thunder stopped. Okay. All right, so let's research. Yeah. You need a circuit board and an electrical one? Yeah, electrical element. Uh, circuit board. One of you and one of you. Okay, get you going. Anything I need charging? No. Um, we did cook this, though. And let's just eat it directly. Give us a little boost there. Otherwise, let's throw a cricket on us. And let's drink some water. There we go. So you're done. What do I need to do here? You need more electrical elements and machine parts. Fifteen machine parts. That's up here. Twenty-five and a twenty-five. And try that again. Okay. You cook away. And cricket is 50. So it's actually going to be a while before we need this. Well, let's clear out the rest of the inventory. Cricket can go down there. You two live there and there. Helium is with fuels. Printing completed. Lure is with miscellaneous until I do a better job of designing my kitchen. And grab you. Yeah, doing this in the air. Let's go up and do it when we can walk around. I think we'll appreciate it more. Okay, up. And nope, that is not the up. Uh, for some reason, I think of W as up. You know, W is forward, but I don't know, it just feels I don't know how far out that strut goes. Let's let's give it some space. Let's be respectful. It can destroy us. Nice, sunny, clear... What? Morning? I think morning. I think it's like 4 in the morning right now. Okay, 300 is where we needed to be. And... I want to be kind of near the edge here. Yeah, that'll do. And I don't want to touch down. That's a mistake I've seen others do. This has to go underneath that a little bit. So two, break you away, put you away, and let's mount you. Three. So this slips. Actually, you see this the socket right there? It fits into one of these. So actually, to do it right, I mean I could make this work. It would it would accept it, but to do it right, you probably have to go right back to where I just was. Um, it needs a single catwalk out there. Okay, so that is better. So you away, put you on, and you just kind of slip right over this guy like that. That's where you're supposed to be. Yeah, looks good. Jump. So, grab this guy by hitting E, and then I think W? Yeah, W sends it out to wherever you're trying to, uh, to mount to, and then click and hold the mouse, and you can rotate it around, up and down, and kind of aim it. And as you're about to hit something, it pulls in all on its own. And that is the docking gangplank. All right, let's go use it. Now, let's try this up. <laughs> he can be taught. Okay, so you guys clean up what you see in here. Now, I need to be kind of low because i got to walk up through that metal. Interesting. Is there another way in? I mean, the, the uh, rebar there is just kind of in the way. So, what's it like up above? Is there... That is the end of 
my height. So I've got 320 in height. Um, hmm. I don't know if there's a roof hatch or not. Let's go around and face it from another direction. Oh, you almost got that copper in there. Good try. Got the other one? Come on. He's right there. He's right there. Yo. It's it's right there. <laughs> okay. Starboard sentry, we're going to have to reprogram you. Yeah. You uh you, you've got some issues. All right, let's swing around. Maybe port sentry will uh will take it out for you as we swing around. There's a good good shot for you. Perfect. Yeah, you got it. Okay, so looking at that top, there's a way in. Oh, there's a door right there. Okay, let's board that way. And this right here just, I don't know, I just got this image. I saw a video today of what Starfield is going to be like. About a 45-minute video that you can see on YouTube. I go through the, uh, oh, the character uh, uh, creation and ship creation and and that you'll be able to board derelict ships and explore them and I want to go down a little bit and uh, if you you know it's, it's a space game for those of you who don't know but it will well I'm trying to find just the right spot to drop a hmm, I guess I have to go up and angle down onto that floor I think it's what I'm going to have to do. Um, that you can attack a like a pirate ship out there, and you can let's see in up. Oh, I see the ship going up and down is a problem. Ah, so even though I've got this, it's going to be so finicky. I'm not going to be able to trust it. Huh? Bummer. Okay, well, I guess we're not going in that way. Anyway, um, that you can choose to attack it and destroy it and then sc scavenge the uh, leftovers. Or you can board it and take it and make it part of your fleet. When I saw that, I gotta say, I was impressed. And I've months ago when they first announced on Keymailer the, uh, that they were looking for, for content creators to uh, play the game, I put my name in the hat. Now I'm a pretty tidy channel so odds are pretty good that they're going to say Noble Who? So it's probably not going to happen. It's a hundred dollar game. So we'll see. But I guess I'm going to go in the way that they meant for me to go in. I'm just going to go in low and send this thing up as high as I can. And we'll see how it works. I guess right on this corner, now this that rebar goes all the way around. All right, well, how close am I at this point? Do I have to crawl to get up there? And don't you dare start lightning on me now. Okay, take you way up and send you across. Yeah, this is a problem. It really is. This ship going up and down. Okay, let's go up a little higher. I guess... <laughs> this might be a, a short walk... A long walk off a short pier or something like that. Yeah, mind the gap. Wow. Okay, where is the... Uh, the quick save. Um, F5, I don't think works on this one. I don't think I can get in that. I don't think I can make the jump. I'm going to hit up here trying to jump it. See that? I can try crawling and just time it really well. Oh, I'm stuck. Go, go. <sighs> yeah, that's annoying. I mean, it, it feels quite realistic, but unrealistically, that gangplank should be banging on it. It shouldn't be auto-retracting. That's a problem. Anyway, we're here. 
<sighs> a little stress. Yeah, I think I'll we'll have a Pepsi. Thank you very much. I'll have a critter too. Whew. Okay. <laughs> I'm feeling better. I might even toss this football around, to tell you the truth. Alright, you live right there. And let's go off to number one. Alright, what's in this place? I have a feeling I better do this quite quick. I don't know what's going to come at us. Or how quickly it's going to throw a storm right at us. Alright, you... Oh, good. Spent an awful lot of you making what it took to get here. So, that just seems appropriate. Nothing left there. Here. Underneath. No. Alright, so, tank. Good. And there's always a reason that they put blocks out there for you to walk on. Always a reason. Hello. I didn't even see you. And that's the hint. It attaches to the ceiling. We're not upside down. It would make more sense if it was more obvious that this used to be a floor. But, yeah, that's kind of odd. Oh, I'll take you. And can one get to there? Um, that might be the way back down. That's possible. So when we came in, I saw a ladder. How did we get here? Uh, how did we get here? Oh. <laughs> oh. Okay. Yeah. There, there. Hmm. Nope. Oh, did it work? It worked. It worked. It worked. <laughs> okay. Sprint is off. Ah, <sighs> there's the ladder. Is it from this side? It is from this side. Okay. Alright, so we've got the recycler now. Don't fall. Or get hit in the face with this door. Nope, nothing there. Over here. First aid kit, uh, repair patch, and some food. Ah, that's where I'm going. I think. So how would one get to there? Okay, so I need to go there. Hmm. Uh, maybe crossbow is what's needed. And get it from the ground. Now, yeah, let's take another run at this. This I wish I could close. Okay. So, I don't see me making that. If I fall, there's no holes in the floor, okay? So, shift, run. No, not even close. Oh, there was a hole in the floor. Yeah. Um, uh. Okay, well. Yeah, that's not all that's decreasing. <laughs> okay. Uh, speaking of. Okay, see, I'm going to hit that if I try and jump. All right, right there. Whew. So you got to get to that from... I don't know. There's no way... I mean, I can see coming back in that way. But I don't see... Going back out. And I can't just put the... Gangplank... Up onto those railings. I mean, I can get there... But I can't get back. You can't jump onto a railing. It won't let you jump that high. So the railing's on the other side. I can't just gangplank onto it and then try somehow get back onto the gangplank. So what is the solution to this puzzle? Wow, those engines go fast. I had forgotten that. I made some a lot more distance than I thought I was. Okay. Um, I've got another plan. I actually like the plan a lot. 
Oh, I can't go up any higher. Ah, okay. I was going to go to the roof. Maybe I can gangplank to the roof and stop it six inches from it so it won't bang and retract. Oh, that's right. Don't go too fast, too far. Spin. And how far did I go? <laughs> okay. So here's our comparison. Look how fast we're, we can travel now. Yeah. Pull back. Actually, a little further. I need to pivot right at that point there. Okay. You go in. This is really as high as I go, right? Yeah, we're maxed. So, a little further. And let me get out there and get some perspective. How do I gangplank to up there? Okay. Is that a thing? So that's where it's going to sit. Or I do something like that. See, I'm at a wonky angle. It kind of likes it. Kinda. Huh. Hmm. Any other places to step out onto this guy from the side out there? Don't see any holes in the walls. Okay. Okay. I'm here. Why? What did I gain? Ah, I gained this. Okay. Yeah, I'm not liking that mechanic. He jumps forward too far. So I guess I'm here to get a machine part. That's it. I'm so glad I came here for machine parts. <laughs> yes, that's sarcasm. Okay, you and not you. Well, I guess... I came here to say that we did it. We conquered. Okay. I still got to get back onto that gangplank. Oh, that's not too bad. Can I go up yet? I can. And here we go. Whew. Okay. Perfect. <sighs> we did it. So, we now have a recycler. Or at least the blueprint of. Um, after this, we have that... Or a windmill. Okay. We passed... We passed a greenhouse. So, we came from here, apparently. Yeah. There up to there. So let's head over toward this area. So we're floating. We are. Pull away. More rain coming. Probably a storm. So, which means storm-powered junk. Hmm. Let's sit up here at 320, well above, until we're actually forced to go down because of lightning. Okay, we're closed. Now, so if it's not going to lightning, then let's do our research. And recycler. Electric components and scrap. You guys and you guys. Our football is out there, but our backup football will be in here. <laughs> Everybody needs a backup football. Where am I going? Right there. And... You. And this should be pretty quick, so let's just get into place here. And that's here. Yeah, you need a transformer and some machine parts. Okay. So, another trans... Nope, oh, up there. There, transformer and machine parts. Two. I guess we'll grab a stack. I don't know how many it's going to take. All right, so deck recycler. There we go. Now, where does that go? I'm kind of thinking here. 
or it is here. Ah, it's glass though. Let's go back to metal up there. So, right there. Metal. Synthetics and metal. Come on, get me out of there. Stack of you, a stack of you. Alright, so two and how do I manage to grab one metal? There's actually a stack of one in there, just random. Okay, wouldn't you know it. I keep hitting that two to bring it out, and it's already out. Okay, you go back in there, and you go back in there. Perfect. So now, we can put this guy... Just like him. Right in that light fixture. Nope, that doesn't work. Okay. Um, I kind of like the idea of it being on this side. So let's do this. You and three is going to go here. Back up a little bit so I can see it better. And looks like closest you're going to go is there. So drifting, click. Perfect. So, needs a battery. Solid state. There we go. Let's go grab some of these boxes to show Cathra exactly how we can make these go away. So, two of you. Oh, I'm out of room. Two is all we get. All right. Uh, three. Right there. Drop the box in. And it's going to give us back 10 metals, 20 synthetics, and a plastic scrap. So actually it's giving us back everything. Very efficient recycler. But it's going to go through and somehow extract all the parts. Kind of reverse 3D printing, apparently. And we've got metal in this one. We've got synthetics. I see. E is to... I see. E is to take it or hold E is to rotate it. Aha. Okay, so we'll take that one and we'll take that one. And it's ready for the its next job. Cool. So, two major accomplishments this episode. Let's drop a bunch of this stuff off. You guys... Is that it? Yeah. And those glass... Okay, you go back into... Actually, you go there. Because you are going to live over here now. So I want cabinets at the entrance there. So it'll go in this corner here. Um, which makes sense. It'd be under the light. So it made more sense than what we did over there. Three. And as tight as possible. Yeah. Put two more cabinets here. So I guess this... Yeah, like... It could be a metal wall instead of glass. Yeah. Maybe it'll let a little bit of light in. All right. So how long have I been recording? Uh, we've still got a few minutes before an hour. Let's build a couple of of wall cabinets. What are you guys? Storage. You are... Actually, all I need is plastic scrap. Got me a whole stack of that. So you, one... And one. And we do have... I uh, keep going there. Here. One big one left, too. So we'll grab that. And let's grab a bunch of... I'll leave a couple. There might be a place where I only need a little bit of storage. So maybe it's worth saving some of those. But let's get you going and recycle. Otherwise, grab you two... And let's put you guys in place. So, not you. That one. What was that? Recycler's finished. Okay, so you're going to bounce around for a while. You are about that far away. I just got stopped by a jar. <laughs> Boom. And you. Just 
just like that. Got to learn to go with the flow of the ship there. All right, so that is going to be this stuff, which isn't going to happen until I've made some room. So, actually, did I need to do that? I'm curious, it'll be the same stuff. Is there any way to, to put more in and not clean out the recycler? Let's find that out. Otherwise, let's empty you uh, metals and you glass there. We've got some foods which don't have any place to go. So I guess I'll go ahead and eat them, or at least eat one. Toss you in there. Um... Too much first aid again. Toss you in there. Too much repair kit. Oh, I know I got hit at one time. What was that? Five. Uh, try that again. Five. I know I got thumped. There you are. Hit you. And you. Just use up some of these repair kits. Okay, so five, and you go into there now. Okay, um, what was that noise? That's right, it was the recycler. So, can I add more to the recycler without taking things out? I cannot. I have to take them out each time, even though I'm just going to be adding to that pile. Okay, fine. We'll do it. Oh, can I put more than one in? All right, we'll experiment with that. Anyway, I need to dump you guys in here. So two of you and you, and then two of you, and then two of you. That looks pretty organized. So grab all of you. Can I do that and do that? Doesn't work. Oh, you're the big one anyway. No, can't do it. Okay. All manual, one at a time. Okay. So you are... You can stay. We're going to move crystals over. So it's you guys next. Fuels. So we'll put the actual fuels at the top. Uh, low, medium, high. And then we'll put in these guys and we'll put in these guys. Okay. And you recycle. Where do I put a big storage cabinet? I guess just dump it into here for the moment till I figure out what actually goes in there. We're kind of gaining back our storage that I had lost, so... Um, you. And that's enough. Well, what else could we get rid of? Repair parts. Can I do a whole stack of repair patches? I had a stack on me. I should have just grabbed my own. Okay. <laughs> I'm curious. What are the limitations of this guy? And how did I manage to hit four? What was that? dehydration. That water is going down so fast these days. It really is. Um, okay, can I put a whole stack in you? Four. I can. Uh, five. Five at a time. Recycle. Good. Now, where am I at? I've already moved everything. Yeah. So let's grab the rest of these guys. You guys go here. Power. Batteries. Um, let's put the 10 in here and keep the 1. Put you in there. And that's all of that. So that means that... Plastics are probably going to be quite abundant. Let's pull you guys out. Move you guys down there. And see how far that goes. Then we'll put you guys in there. What was that? That was plastics. Okay. 
And polymer is down here. Actually, let's reverse that. Polymers at the top, because up here is going to be what makes polymers. Yeah. That feels kind of organized. Yep. Yep. You. You. And I think we have a wrap here. Okay. Well, we found the, the beast tower. Where am I at? We took off from... Yeah, we found the tall tower. Did they have a name? If they did, it's probably long gone now, huh? No, High Point. Okay, good. So we found High Point. I don't know that there's much left to find. Let's see here. Let's, let's not be at the very edge. Okay, so scanning-wise, we have hit every variant that's available of all the different towers. Research, we have 95... Oh, it's because we didn't do the the helium fuel. And there was another fuel. Yeah. And then virus samples. Vertigo, we haven't made one of those yet. Let's get out of here. Just drop. Um, spin. Let's go down underneath this guy. Oh! We're there! Up! Let's go forward! I was closer than I thought. Panic! Panic! Okay, drop. There we go. Coming around. Keep dropping. I think we're clear of everything up there now. Okay. So let's just let this sit here and get back to where I was. Okay. So, studies. We haven't made the vertigo... Um, it requires a cricket. Oh, we haven't used the cricket to make the other version of this. Okay. So we've basically done it all at this point. I know we have some pretty big updates coming. I want to say September. So I think I'm going to put this series on hold. And when updates come out... Well, a few days after an update comes out, because whenever an update comes out, you wait for all the hot fixes to come out and not be the uh, the save that got bricked because they didn't quite test it all the way. <laughs> I've learned that lesson. So, yeah, a few days after, a week after the next big update comes out, I'll pop back into the series and we'll, uh, we'll continue. But... Uh, We'll say goodbye to, uh, to Poncho there, and, and I think I'm going to call this one done. It's a Noble Rambler. Catch you next time, folks. Bye-bye.